going on a bear hunt. We're going on a bear hunt. Eagles? Yeah. I didn't see them. You heard them. Oh, I heard them. Look at Brandon. All the way down there. We're at Point Defiance Park and we are taking a walk in the cold winter days. Brandon's doing his Rocky Balboa. It's pretty cold, but it's nice to take a walk. Because we haven't done that in forever. Me and Jeremy are walking through the woods for exercise. And it's cold. What it is what it is. This tree looks pretty though. My hand up on my Yeah. Huh? It's cold out. Yeah. It's cold as hell. <laughs> But let me just say that I had a revelation just earlier when we were at home because I was watching my old vlogs because I haven't vlogged in a long time. And well, one of the reasons was because um, we didn't pay for our, what was that service called? The editing program through Adobe. And I'm out of breath, I don't care. I'm still gonna upload this because we're walking, so it don't matter if it's freezing. But my elevation was that I hadn't vlogged also because oh, this is zoomed in. Oops, this is my life. It was because I was going through a lot of things, like my health was not all the way good, like with my PCOS and stuff like that. Testosterone was high, making me go crazy, not feel good. So if you have PCOS, you will know how that can affect you and make you not feel good like health and all around. And there's other things too, like with my eating habit, not eating habits, but style of lifestyle change. From when I first started to do YouTube, I was so happy and all that stuff, but I was feeling different, but I was more heavier. But you can see now I lost weight, which is good, but I need to lose more weight. But um, Maybe I can help people with that because I didn't realize that too and I feel like when I lost weight I just <laughs> realized it. it's not a lot but it makes you feel different, you look different and sometimes that can be really shocking to you. <sighs> a lot of breath. But it could be shocking to you because you know I used to sing that. <laughs> for me I felt like I lost myself but I've always been here. I just watched my vlogs and I saw that the hobby was, and then I realized all that I went through, and now here I am. I'm still progressing as a person, but I should have vlogged it more. And Jeremy's in the back struggling with this thing. But we all go through struggling struggles, and I just want to make more YouTube and make more friends and meet people. Because I don't have a lot of friends, but I need to. I don't get out much, but that's okay too. But I'm determined this year, I think. And my birthday's in a few days, and I just love the outdoors, so it's good to be out here. But that's basically what's been going on with me. But I wanna make a habit to vlog more, make other videos too. I don't know what yet though, cause mostly time-lapse drawing and stuff like that. And that will be on the menu. The ground is cold. Hey guys. Looking cute. Huh? It feels good though. I like it. Because we haven't gone out in a long time. The ground's frozen. Pacific Northwest. <sighs> Walking through the forest reminds me of this documentary I just watched on YouTube recently about this old mountain man. I think he supposedly lives in Washington too. And how they say, like, for your happiness and for your health, you should... Well, his theory was that you get outside 
and you go to the woods like where you began, where people began before cities and all that. And I actually believe that that's actually good for us. Because it's like natural walking, but he said he does it barefoot, but I ain't doing it barefoot. It's too cold. My feet will freeze. There's no snow. But our feet will be frozen and bloody. That We'd have. Bloody. We would get frostbite for sure. Well, how long you gotta go barefoot for? I just said for a few minutes. No, this guy. Well, probably not in winter time. He probably puts like moccasins on or something. But yeah, I think it looks pretty cool of him though to do that, to go back to the roots and live in the land, because he thinks that city life is not good. I mean, we're still in the city. Well, this point of us is in the city. But it's like a little piece of land. I'm about to fall over that stick. Oh, my hands. Last year, where we, they were running up and down, running up and down. Um, I'm not ready to run up it yet. Maybe one day, but I'm not going to. Because I'm not, I'm cold as fuck. But I'm walking up it. I'll walk up it. I got motivation to walk up it. Here they go. Here Brandon comes. Here comes Jeremy waddling down. Here comes Sashiana. Me, yeah, I'm powering it. Last year I had so much trouble walking up this hill. But now it's easier and I don't have to struggle breathing because because I'm 20 pounds lighter from that now. And I'm gonna do it one more time, I think. I don't wanna fall coming down though, cause it's a little harder. But I walked up that pretty good. A lot better than the last time that I walked up it. That was good. <laughs> so that's a good thing for me, I feel proud of that. It was a lot easier than last year. I'm still breathing heavily, but not nowhere near as bad. So I just walked up and down two times. Last year couldn't do that, bitches. Last year couldn't do that. Seriously, I couldn't. I couldn't. And I did two times. No, which way are we going? And I'm not even tired like that. Awesome possum. She ran though, but I'm not gonna run. Maybe one day I'll run. Not just uh, maybe during the summer I can run up the hill. <coughs> but I did good. <sighs> Jeremy's lungs are hurting. But that was really good. You gonna run up one more? They're gonna run up again. But I think I did really good. We're not done walking, we're gonna walk some other trails too. But I'm proud of myself, that's a goal. You guys, if you have PCOS, and you like me, and if you watch my vlogs, which, thank you for watching my vlogs if you are. I have 54 subscribers and I thought I didn't have that many, which is crazy, so in the meantime, when I wasn't really, bleh. <laughs> in the meantime, when, in the meanwhile, when I was not making videos, um, people still followed me, which is cool, I guess. But yeah, if you haven't watched my vlogs and this is your first time, I say go watch the ones in the back and you can definitely see I was a lot heavier than I am now and things were a little bit harder for me. But through lifestyle change, like things like this, instead of being lazy, which I am lazy still sometimes, but getting out more, it's good for you. It's good for you and your heart. It makes you strong. <laughs> A little dead bird. It's like a swallow. Poor baby swallow. Is it? But I don't know what it is. we live in the forest, so everything 
that dies goes back to the earth. Nothing is wasted. That's the beauty of the outside world like this, huh, Jeremy? I mean, I guess it's sad that it died, but it could feed other organisms and go back into the earth. It smells good out here. We all need someone to lean on. Sometimes in our lives, we all have faith. We all have sorrow, but it we will why Always tomorrow, lean on me when you're not strong. I'll be your friend. I'll help you care.